and welcome back to another episode of Nation Battles, guys. In today's episode, guys, if you remember from yesterday's episode, we saw a Skyrim dragon or something like that. Uh, we could not get up to it without a flying dragon, but I still don't have a flying dragon uh, unless he grew, uh, which I hope he did, but probably not. Um... We're going to figure out a way to get up there today. Or we're just going to look, because now that I think of it, it's pretty much impossible without a flying dragon. Uh, so yeah, we're going to be looking around for more dragons today. We're going to be sort of keeping it calm, hopefully get some new mail. I just got my new TV in, as you can see. Uh, look at my channel. Uh, eventually, every one hour, this dot will move to here. Then we'll move here, then we'll move here, then we'll move here. Then it will keep doing that this whole time. And that's my TV. <laughs> yep, it is very fun looking right now. But this is just an ancient, or not ancient castle. This is my castle that doesn't have internet or service. So yeah, I don't have anything, pretty much. But I do have a TV remote here, which I can uh, do nothing with. <laughs> So, yeah, that's just great. Also, guys, I have a Thunder Drum, an Elemental Dragon Egg. That one of them we will be hatching in today's episode, guys. Uh, I am so sorry, guys. In the last episode, I was supposed to tell you a competition so you could vote which one I was going or which one of these I was going to open in the next episode, which would be this one. But since I forgot to tell you guys to do that, I'm going to hatch both in this episode, guys. So that's going to be like a little treat uh, for leaving likes on this video. Uh, make sure you go leave a like and subscribe if you enjoy Nation Battles. It really helps. It really does. So let's go downstairs and start our journey to look for a nice dragon. So we have... The new things also you'll see around that the castle. It is nice little weather deflectors just in case if we have a storm, uh, it can deflect it from hitting our castle. So yeah, that's pretty good. And you'll see it pretty much everywhere. Ow, oh, I almost fell down the water. Like you'll see it. I hit it inside though, so we didn't really see it. But you'll also see. Like the sirens I put up there so we can hear if a tornado's coming. But also, guys, let's see if the science nation took or at least mailed us back the results of the, um, of the, what's it called? The enemy dash, I don't know, the nation. So, uh, yeah, let's just check our mail and see what this happens. Ah, oh, it's a sleeping dragon. I'm gonna check out that in a second. Did they mail us anything? Uh, oh! They did! They wrote back! I got a dragon horn, which I could use for my fire dragon. Oh my gosh, the leaves are blowing my house. I'm gonna have to get that fixed. <laughs> I'm gonna have leaves to clean up now. Look at all of them. Well, I'm getting distracted. I got a dragon horn, which means I can... That dragon's really scaring me, but you know what? Um, I at least got a dragon horn, so now I can use this to suck out my uh, fire dragon. And I also got this. I crafted that yesterday. Um, but there's also a book. And hopefully this is going to be, because there's no sponge in anything of the blood or anything. So hopefully this will give us... A, um, a little, maybe the nation, what they wrote, and maybe it's the science nation. Maybe it is the science nation. Um, so, it could be them, if they just wrote, we're coming. I don't know, let's read this and see what's in it. Our research has concluded, and it is the void nation. They don't mess around. Be careful. If you need us, don't be afraid to call us for help. 
Glad to see your nation's back. Hmm. Well, we know it's probably not the science nation because they're glad to see your nation's back. And they told us our research, research has concluded, which means ended. And it is the void nation. They do not mess around. Be careful. If you need us, don't be afraid to call us for help. Glad to see your nation's back. Well, we know they're allies, I think, maybe. Leave that in the comment section below, guys. I, this could all be just a lie. Uh, but I don't know. Uh, a void nation. Void nation. And hold up, guys. The reason why I'm so scared about that dragon, guys, is because this is the mailing dragon or one of the mailing natters i've known this guy or this one from the science nation from was just a little tiny baby like you re if you remember my old nation spots i seen a tiny little natter that's how small this guy was and i seen him when he was a baby i'm pretty sure or her it's a her am i right if it's a her i know it it is a heart. Is she breathing? No. No. No way. They killed it. Confirmed it's not the science nation because that's one of their baby natters or were one of their babies natters oh. It's dead There's no heartbeat It's not breathing It died it was killed because it probably dropped off the mail. But where's the person? Because there's someone who rides them, right? He gave me the mail. The dragon's dead and the person who was riding the dragon is nowhere to be found. shoulder though. Alright buddy, you can stay there. Thunder's gone so big too! Look at Thunder! You're huge! That's very good. I need more of the farm. I could have a lot of stuff there, but nothing in there. And look at the bewildered beast size! Oh my! bigger than last episode, right? Look how big it is! Ah! Oh my god, no way it was this big. I'm literally standing underneath of it. That is so crazy. Don't eat me. Ah! <laughs> eat this. Oh my god. Look how big this guy is. Oh. Good night. He's huge. Good girl. Yes, you are. You're good girl. 
today but we're gonna go to sleep and i'll see you in the morning hopefully to uh go find that dragon yeah or dragon. actually no we're gonna hatch the two dragons today or tomorrow yeah i'll see you tomorrow i'm gonna get my remote and i'm gonna beep <sighs> what a beautiful day ah Nice morning. Time to go and find or catch these two dragons, which we're going to do the thunder drum first, just to get some hype up for the next one, which is definitely a little cooler. It depends on what you like. Do you like water dragons or do you like uh, flying everywhere? That dragon's still here. That's not a good sign. That really isn't. But it's alright. It is alright. Let's just go put our thunder drum in the incubator. And it should be incubating. Definitely gonna need more water. So let's go create an infinite water source right here. Just so we don't have to do this boring trick multiple times. Let's just go do that. The weather's definitely picking up over here. So that's really not good. But. Are gonna get some we don't have to run over here every single time. Because even though it's like a short distance and I don't have to run that far, I still wanna have a, a close proximity of you know what that means. So let's get that. We're gonna put all this in here, and then when this guy's finished, I will see you in a minute. Or I guess we can yeah, I'll just season a minute, actually. I'm gonna do some research, also, on the Boy Nation. Why, while I am waiting for that. For, yeah. For this to be incubated. So. I'll see you in a minute. Alright, everybody. It is officially incubated, which means I can hatch it in a second if I place it down. But before we do that, I wanna get the other egg, and I wanna see if this dragon has it's been there, you gotta think. This thing took two hours just to incubate. It's been dead there for overnight. Like, you gotta think, overnight, because that was a long time I slept. It's not gonna, it's not waking up. I should write a message back to the, um, Science Nation saying, I don't know what happened, but... is dead. I don't know about the messenger, but the dragon is dead. I don't know how uh, I'm gonna like, get out of it because I did not do this. Um, so yeah, it's very confusing for me. Uh, I still to this day have no clue who has done it. I've done research. But the research, as you guys know, is very limited. What I'm thinking is, you know how in the Egyptian temple that we went in last episode, guys, if you haven't seen it, make sure you go check it out, because it was a pretty fun episode. We checked out a temple which had a lot of bookshelves in it. And that bookshelf might actually have something 
to do with our little crisis of the void mission, guys. So we might have to go check that out after this, or while I'm looking for this thing to hatch. Uh, after this. So, um, because the next thing we're gonna do is hatch both of these at once in the dragon farm area over there. Then, I think for this episode, guys, it's going to be short today. Well, I didn't mean it to be, but there's really not much that I could do right now, if you understand what I mean. Because the nation is so incredibly small. I don't have any nation members. I can't go for the party that I could afford. There's really nothing to be doing and entertaining for you guys that I could, like, film right now. Which is really sad because I don't usually do that. But, you know what? It's alright. Once we have our wildebeest grown and our, all of our dragons grown and a nation actual that has actual people in it, like an actual civilized nation, um, will be able to get set out. I'm planning on getting people from my old, eh, not my old nation. Uh, I was gonna say that, but guess what? Um, they're all dead. I don't know. Uh, I saw some get captured. I know Dr. James is not going to make it because he got slain on the spot. Like I told you in the last episode. Um, so, yeah. I don't know who I'm going to get at. I'm probably just going to have to find a random village and say, You all want to be a part of the huge Falcon Nation? And they're going to all say yes. And that's how it's going to work. Yeah, that's just imaginary there. Oh, the elemental and the thunder drum is ready. So let's just hatch these and forget all about that. And let's have a good time hatching these eggs. So let's go over here. That dragon's following me. I put my dragons over here and get there. No, they're all fine. Look at them. Look how good they are over here. He's so big. He towers everything. Also, guys, leave some name suggestions for our three baby children. We need some name suggestions. Like, imagine, guys, this guy needs a name behind me. The Elemental and Thunder Drum are also going to need a name. So make sure if you want to name these, make sure you the comment section below and name these guys. So let's just feed you here. And we're going to hatch the Thunder Drum first. Is it going to be a male or a female, guys? So, three, two, one, boom. <laughs> boom. It is a female thunder drum, guys. So, I'm going to just name it Wave. Wave or Current. No. Tidal Wave. <laughs> no, just Wave. I want you to create the name of our new baby thunder drum female. Look at her! She's so cute. This little baby thunder drum. She's actually not that small. She's actually pretty big. And she's almost the size of a level 20 or stage 20 drum color. Hmm. I guess they're very small now. I've never actually had a baby thunder drum. So the first, look at them. All right, make sure you leave your name suggestions for this baby little thunder drum. And then we're gonna hatch our very own <laughs> elemental female dragon, guys. So now we're gonna go here and name it. Hmm. Uh, I don't really know what I would call this one. I don't know. I'm just gonna call it land. <laughs> no. Um. Frost. No. Mm. I don't know. What would I name this dragon? Uh. 
I'm gonna call it Taria. Taria. I think that's what it's called. Taria. It is land in Spanish. I think that's a pretty good name. But you can also name this guy in the comments if you have good names. Look at this girl. Now she's small. She's tiny in comparison. But look at how cute she is. She's so cute. Look at the tiny little baby. They're both females. Hey, you eat. Eat. Eat up, bud. Why not? Then you eat. You don't want to eat? You want fish. That's not good because I don't have fish yet. But when he's grown, that bewilderbeast back there, we're going to have some fish. So let's go over here. And um, I'm going to just play with these guys for a little while. And I'm going to feed them. And uh, pretty much I'm going to do the maintenance of the food. It's a true thing, dragon people. And it stinks over. I'm also going to do some crop work. Honestly, I do need to get doing my crops. As you see, they're all grown, which is really like, eh. In the Spanish. So, yeah. They're all pretty much grown. Uh, these pieces, I guess, are not grown for some reason. I don't know. Uh, but it's alright. I'm just gonna harvest it all right now. And then I'll see you in a minute. to that dragon. Let's go check this out. There's something there. I should get something before. I should definitely get something before the room straight in, guys. little handy blank over here so let's just do that fast don't know how I got two books but that's all right put that and you should be in the rain. Of course. When I want it not to, it rains now. Um, so, there's the portal blocks on the floor. Holy mackerel! Bad storm! Gotta get inside, bad storm.
this storm would move on. Please, storm, move. The sirens had to stop, which me, which is a good sign. But now it is pouring, which is also a very bad sign. We're gonna check out that camp. Just to make sure that there's nothing problem or stuff going on. Because I have shoes and water on, which makes me allowed to step on this. So thankfully I do. There's TNT dynamite here. So whoever these were, a map? <gasps> That's our nation right there. That is our nation. That's the original nation spot, and that's where we moved. That is not good. There's a fire slowly be going out, so they obviously were not, or they were in a rush to get up. A skeleton. The, the mount. The guy who is the messenger. The messenger of the giant's nation. Him and his dragon were killed. How am I going to explain this? I think that is him. It might be. I would need the science nation to test the DNA. So, um, to figure out for sure, I would have to tell the science nation to get help with whoever this was. I would need the science nation. Do you know what predicament this is? This is not very good. They had a tent. They had a fire running. There's nothing in the tent. Is there anything around the camp? We're going to get rid of these dynamites because you know what I don't need? A blowing up. And we're not going to let this map get leaked. Uh, because I do not want my location revealed. Sorry. No. That ain't happening to other nations. And there's a book bag. Which I just found. And that has a book. Hmm. A book. Another book. That's just great. I love these books. They're so fun. Watch this be more bad news. Or some bad news. Hopefully it's good news. And hopefully the good guys caught these people. Um. So let's hope. This is good news. Attack. Oh. Attack plans. Tomorrow we're going to attack the Falcon. Before reading this all. They are going to attack us tomorrow. That's very bad. And we're not prepared at all. So let's get stuff prepared. Uh. After reading this, I'm going to have to get stuff prepared. And I'm going to guess i got to see you in the next episode when I do that. So let's re continue reading this. Tomorrow we're going to attack the Falcon Nation. While doing so, killing his dragons and torturing his own people in front of him. Ha! It's going to be great. Torturing his own people in front of him. What? Didn't everyone die? No, some were captured. It is the Void Nation. It has to be. Because the Science Nation didn't capture my people. It has to be the Void Nation. Because the Void Nation had an alliance with the Fire Nation. That is not good. So, yep, we're gonna uh, take this book for further knowledge, and, um, and, um, I guess I'll see you in the next one. Um, that is not good news, like, at all. That is actually terrible news. Uh, but the only good news we got today was the DNA thing, which I guess was not good news. Trouble. The only good news is Wade here, which will also 
need a name. So if you want a name and have a better name for this baby little thunder drum girl, you can name her in the comment section below. Just leave a name and say thunder drum, which just put th if you don't know how to spell it. Th, the name you want to name. It. Pretty much, it's very easy. That's all you need to do. And also, we have Korea, which means land, land in Spanish, because it's an elemental, it means every single thing for the areas. So, you can also name her if you want to. Uh, I already named these guys, but if you have a good name, you can name them. And you can also name this guy. Our fire dragon, just put FR if you don't want to spell it. And you can name this beautiful little dragon here. So, if you just want to name any of those, make sure to leave it in the comment section below. And I will see you in the next one, probably out of war. But, before we see you in the next one, there's actually one more thing I need to do. I am going to leave this off here because I don't need to show you how I write books anymore. I'm going to write the science mission for some help in the next episode, hopefully this year, which is going to be tomorrow. So, uh, hopefully the science nation will come and help us in this war. So, uh, technically it's a little war. It's a very small war. But it's, it's a fight. I don't know if it's actually going to be a small war. I hope they bring out the whole army because, um... Um, they have iron stuff. They have, um, Vintanicalist steel. Yeah, I'm weak. So, but we do have the alpha baby wildebeest that you need training and everything. We need to train him. Uh, it's not gonna be fun. But I'll see you in the next one. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye!